two departments have lower tuition fee and maybe six department has tuition fee moving above 5,000 euros. I didn't, I will not mention here, an example include um, Charles University in Prague. Guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel and thank you so much for joining today. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe guys. Subscribe and let's move this channel to 30,000 subscribers. Thank you so much for understanding. I know you have done that already. Today's video is a very interesting video and because the admissions is open or let's say admissions is already ongoing in most European countries, I decided to make this video here so that if you are looking for uh, maybe affordable universities in Europe to study in and equally if your proof of funds is just maybe 5 million Naira or 5 million CFA francs, just say $6,000 or 5000 or even $3,000, this is a country you should consider. And in this country, I'm going to be talking about some universities, some affordable universities, I would like to specify this, that you can apply to and as well move to this country. The country I'm going to be talking about is called the Czech Republic. And I have with me some universities here that I'm going to be telling you their range of tuition fee or some little critics that you need to know or little details that you need to know about this school. But know that any university I mention here is somehow affordable or maybe cheap, all right, for you to study a bachelor's or a master's degree program inside. Equally understand that I didn't mention in this particular video, I will not be mentioning those universities that maybe two departments have lower tuition fee and maybe six departments has tuition fee moving above 5,000 euros. I didn't, I will not mention here, an example include um, Charles University in Prague. This university, if you want to study medicine or medicine in Czech Republic, you should consider this university, I think with 10,000 euros upwards you can study medicine in charles university it may seem expensive but not very expensive to other students so if you are looking for cheaper universities in the czech republic you have to stay watching this video and remember that for you to study in the czech republic the application process is not that complicated but it may be complicated if this is your first time on this channel and it may be complicated for you if you are not very patient and if you are not very knowledgeable with the uh, pc or maybe a laptop but however i'm going to be giving you these schools and i'll add the links in the video description box so that you can equally just follow the links and of course you navigate through and you apply for programs remember that the application process for czech republic goes in stages the very first stage you have to go to is to register online where you need just your international passport then the second stage is the university is going to check your documents and of course you go to the next stage where you have to upload your documents then they will take time to check the documents and if the documents are good remember at the first stage which was uploading of your passport and of course filling in your details you had to pay maybe an administrative fee then the third stage which is controlling your documents they will check if your documents are okay then they will tell you to do legalization remember at a certain stage you would equally need what is called notification and this notification if you do not have certified officials in your particular in your home country then you will need to put the documents your original documents here i mean and send them through dhl or fedex to the czech republic and of course after they verify and your documents are okay you would be issued an admissions letter now let's go to the universities like i said i will be naming them in any order and i will not be giving you a particular range all right i will start with the very first university i already talked about is charles university in prague and this particular university is a, a little more expensive so i cannot put it in the list and you will not find it in the description box because it looks expensive to me now let's Let's go to the next university which is called medel university medel university is a university in the czech republic and is located in the czech, czech capital of bino and with medel university if you have 1600 euros to like maybe 3000 euros of course you can study at medel university equally understand that some schools in the czech republic are not accepting instrumental payment because I received these questions from many people. They are like, Milton, please, do they accept instrumental plan? No, they don't accept like Portugal. But however, some few universities and one is here, which I'm going to be mentioning very soon, they can accept instrumental 
payment. So the first school is Medel. The second school is Masaryk University. Masaryk University is equally located in the city of Bino. And at Masaryk University, or if you apply for a degree program, you are going to be paying maybe 2,400 to like 3,000 500 euros and some faculties like the faculty of education has a lower tuition fee all right the tuition fee is distributed according to faculties faculties like the education faculty they have a lower tuition fee why other faculties like maybe the arts the science and the engineering in this particular order from top to bottom their tuition fee increases i hope you understand then you equally have a university like the university of Harad Dek Kralov, all right. It is called Radek Kralov. It's just that the edge in front is some co how complicated. With this university, you can easily find departments that you can pay one thousand euros, two thousand euros, two five, all right. But the range is to four thousand euros. Then, depending on the program, like I told you, and the department in which you want to study in, the programs are not the same they don't cost the same tuition fee the next school i want to talk about is thomas barta university thomas barta university is located in the city of zlin z l i n and with this university you are going to be paying around 54 53 54 55 check krona thousand check krona 55000 or 54000 check krona all right for their bachelor's and master's uh, degree programs and again because of this tuition fee which is very up all right it's almost the same like uh, charles university in prague but the reason i mentioned this particular school is because of the scholarships you can get a 75 percent scholarship in this particular university or you can even get 50 percent they can give you scholarships all right so you have to apply and remember the scholarship is only on merit base so if you are applying to this school and your grades are good and you put in an excellent application at the end of the day you may even just pay maybe five thousand check crown which means that you have been given like 75 to 85 percent uh, of uh, scholarship all right so the next university i want to talk about which is the third to the last is czech university of life sciences we check university of life sciences this is one of the most cheaper schools in the czech republic you can pay just ten thousand check uh krona all right and check thousand ten thousand check krona is equivalent to around 420 21 euros so this is something you should verify and remember departments vary from program to program guys so you should know this and each department has its own cost all right they are going to charge you differently but just know that the range is you are going to get things related to ten thousand check crown which is equivalent to like 420 425 and some faculties like the faculty of environmental science are very cheap Ten thousand, you are good to go probably just 500 euros maximum you are going to be studying environmental science and some other faculties like economics. Those are the bigger faculties that has the higher tuition fee. And of course, MBA programs at Czech University of Life Sciences. Now, another university I want to talk about here is Metropolitan University in Prague. Before I will conclude with the cheapest school in Czech Republic so far that I have seen. And I cannot say it is uh, the cheapest. I can say it is a free school. All right. But first, know that at Czech at Metropolitan University, all right, in Prague, this is a school located in Prague, you can pay the tuition fee in installments. And the tuition fee is 59,000 Czech Krone. It all depends again on the program. The reason I brought this against here is because you can pay in installments, all right, which means that they can you can tell them that you are going to be paying three times per semester or two times per semester until your money is finished maybe at the end of the semester or after one year you are going to be paying five thousand uh maybe you are going to be paying five times that's maybe two times or three times per semester and you are good to go they accept instrumental payment that is metropolitan university in prague all right i hope you understand at the beginning of this video i said that some schools in the czech republic would not accept instrumental plan but this particular one takes instrumental payment so you can discuss with them and of course you launch your application and you will be good to go all right then the next school which i said is almost free is called university of south behomia i recently have a video about this university but i decided to bring it back here so that i clarify something someone watched that video and 
insulted me should i say the person said some nasty things i don't really want to mention certain things here but the person was trying to say that i am trying to dish out information which is not correct which i really don't find it uh, knowledgeable well it that is how people are the social media is like that you will meet people like that and we move this university i can say it is a free school because how much are they going to charge you they are going to charge you 500 check crown how much is 500 check crown if you look at this at the end of the day this is just a registration fee so the university of south behomia is a free school in the czech republic as i can term it and again if you want to study science programs like biology uh mathematics artificial intelligence uh, applied mathematics physics chemistry all right biochemistry this is a university you should consider and with this 500 Czech crown, you are good to go. Another advantage with the University of South Bahamia in Czech Republic is that you have this, you stand a chance to get a joint degree or a double degree. That is to say, there is a university in Austria that has partnership with these science courses, especially biological chemistry. All right, with uh, this university in Austria, it is called Johann Kepler's University. If you are studying a course at this university, uh, University of South Bahamia, there is a possibility for you to finish a course in Austria at Johann Kepler's University. And in this case, if you have to do it that way, it means that your degree is going to be a joint degree. I hope you understand. This is the reason I wanted to explain this to you so that you understand well, so you know what you are doing. I hope this video was helpful to somebody. If it was helpful, please do not forget, give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to our channel please subscribe let's get 10 uh, 30 000 subscribers guys till we meet again in another one